So the other day, Ben Joyce set the world record for the fastest pitch thrown in college baseball at 105.5 miles an hour. And today, we're gonna see if I can hit that. All right, we got a little bit of math. I gotta tell you guys real quick so you can understand how this is going to happen. So I'm standing at the wiffle ball field that I built at the backyard of my house. And obviously you can't throw a wiffle ball 105 miles an hour. So we are doing this based on reaction time. If you guys have ever watched any of the Little League World Series games, they do this reaction time equivalency on the games, except they pitch from 46 feet, six inches. So they're another six and a half feet back than what we are pitching right here. I have the mound set exactly 40 feet from home plate. And I have a radar gun set up behind home plate that hopefully you guys can see. Now I have it's set in kilometers per hour because honestly the numbers look cooler during a game. When we play our actual series out here, the speed limit that I have set, the fastest that you're allowed to throw is 100 kilometers per hour, which equates to 62 miles per hour, which equates to a reaction time of a 94 mile an hour fastball. So in order for me to say that I can hit Ben Joyce, I have to hit a ball that travels at least 112 kilometers per hour. So today I've got my good buddy Pudge coming over. Pudge played college baseball. He was my catcher in high school as well as summer ball, and he's a freaking unit. But the other day we played Pudge's team in a series out here and I literally watched this man throw at 121 kilometers per hour. That equates to the reaction time of a 113 mile an hour fastball. So not only am I gonna be able to hit off of Ben Joyce, I'm gonna hit a home run on the fastest pitch ever thrown, or I'm gonna strike out a lot. We'll see. All right, I'm gonna just, let me just see a couple. See what I'm dealing with here. 116, that's already like 107. <laughs> 160, that's, that's ridiculous. I literally can't see anything. God. All right, we're good. No. It'd be funny if I get hit. 119. I'm sure everybody would love it if I got hit. Dude, I feel like it's in the strike zone before I swing. Dude, this is just. It's like I blink and it's gone. <laughs> Bro, I literally have to start my swing before you throw it. Dude, and it's cutting. It's moving like six inches. 114. These are all faster than the world record, by the way. God. Woo! 115 at the face. Uh, oh my God. <laughs> see, I'm all, I'm just, I'm messed up now. There's people that get paid millions of dollars to see this shit. I feel like I've never played baseball all day in my life. You're not gassing it up now? <laughs> all right, I'm swinging. I'm just fucking going for this motherfucker. I'm gonna hit the shit out of this. Fuck you! All right. All right, I got this. Hit this motherfucker in my pool. I feel like my obliques are tearing, trying to swing his bat. Am I ready? <laughs> 128? That's the fastest I've ever seen. It almost hit me. Man, just imagine one of those off the tip of the wiener. That's bad when it can bounce off the back side and come right back to you. I need to see some contact. We're gonna go lefty contact. Ow! <laughs> uh, I swung at that. <laughs> I don't know if people can see how ridiculous this is or not. Shit. Oh, all right, I was a little more on that one. Oh. <laughs> I would love to do a side-by-side -side slow down to see if I'm actually starting my swing before you even throw it. I gotta be close. Oh, how did I miss that? Get low. Oh, oh. God, I've been waiting on you to throw one high and you did it and I missed it. Oh. That rose. My GoPro went off my head. This is so hard. Hey, this is gonna be great for when you drop it down to 100. Look like changeups, just big fat volleyballs coming in. All right, I want you to lob me one in there so I can see contact again. 
No. High and down the middle. <laughs> you want it high and down the middle? Yeah. Throws it at my forehead. I can do it, man. I can do it. So I've definitely got the swing down. It's, it's just about making contact. That's it. You need a groove one in 130. You think you're good? I broke the strike zone again. 130. Are you serious? Man, literally grooved one in. <laughs> I don't know what the reaction time is on that, but I'm gonna put it on the video right now, whatever it is. And I already know it's gonna be fucking dumb. Ooh. <sighs> Listen, man, I wasn't a bad hitter in high school. I was early. <laughs> Right on the end of the bat. Oh, dude, that was it. And I rolled over on it. Go! Go! Fuck! <laughs> Got in contact three times, and that's three times more than I thought I would get. God! You threw it. How? <laughs> Talk about seeing your life flash for you guys. Oh, shit! Woo! <laughs> I'm glad I gave you a glove. <laughs> man, that reaction time. Look at you. Hey man, that would've went out if you didn't touch it. That was screaming. Go! 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 No! I tried, man. I tried. <laughs> uh, damn. 128, final pitch. All right. I want to give a nice big thank you to Pudge, who was on another baseball team during the league. You were literally chucking him like 125 to 130. Big thanks to this guy. I'm just going to keep doing this. He's a boxer. So anybody on the YouTube platform wants to challenge him, he's a YouTuber now. You can fight him. Go to ringside. Go to ringside. Ringside Elite. Ringside Elite. Anything else? That's all. All right, cool. Uh, if you guys want us to do this again, let us know. And next time he can mix in like curveballs and stuff like a real pitcher and make it even harder. Yep. So that'd be great. All right. Bye.